Christ is risen, Christ is risen, joy from heaven is around us, Christ our past now dwells among us, lift your hearts and lift your voices, mankind gratefully rejoices, God gave gladness from above. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. Heaven's joy has come upon us. Heaven's hester ends all sadness. On this day with joy declaring, God has given, we are sharing. We are saved from all distress. Christ is risen, Christ is risen. Christ is risen, Christ is risen. All from slumber now mm -hmm. are risen. On this day new life is given. Earth and heaven heard the story of the triumph and of the glory. All rejoice, for we are blessed. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. Blessed is the kingdom of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and forever. Amen. Christos was crescent is mertwe, smerti u smert poprav. Isus čim vorobi život da. is risen from the dead by death he trampled death and to those in the tombs he's granted life Jesus, in peace, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For peace from the high and for salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For peace in the whole world for stability of the holy churches of God and for the union of all, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this holy church and for all who enter it with faith, reverence and fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For our holy father, Francis, Pope of Rome, for our most reverend metropolitan William, for our God-loving Bishop Kurt, for the venerable presbyterate, the deaconate in Christ and all the clergy and people, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For our government and for all in the service of our country, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the city, for every city community, and for the faithful living in them, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For favorable weather, for an abundance of the fruits and the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have 
have mercy. For those who travel by sea, near and land, for the sake of the suffering, the captive, and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. That we be delivered from all affliction, wrath, and need. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Protect us, save us, have mercy on us, and preserve us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady, the Theotokos and ever Virgin Mary, with all the saints, let us commit ourselves and one another and our whole life to Christ our God. To you, O Lord. Lord our God, mighty beyond description, glorious above all, understanding, merciful without limits, loving us, all beyond ex expression, look with compassion on us, and on this holy church, O Master, and show us and those who pray with us the riches of your tender mercy. For to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, is due all glory, honor, and worship, now and ever and forever. Amen. Shout joyfully to the Lord, all the earth. Sing praise to his name, give to him glorious praise. Through the prayers of the Theotokos, O Savior, save us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and forever. Amen. Through the prayers of the Theotokos, O Savior, save us. Be gracious to us, O God, and bless us. Let your face shine upon us and have mercy on us. O Son of God, risen from the dead, Save us who sing to you. Alleluia. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Now and ever and for. and ever virgin Mary and became man without change. You were also crucified, O Christ our God, and by death have trampled death, being one of the Holy Trinity, glorified with the Father and the Holy Spirit, save us. Let God arise and let his enemies be scattered, and let those who hate him flee from before his face. Christ is risen from the dead. By death he's trampled dead, and to those in the tombs he's granted life. As smoke vanishes, so let them vanish, as wax melts before a fire. Christ is risen from the dead. By death he's trampled dead, and to those in the tombs he's granted life. In so let the wicked perish at the presence of God, but let the righteous ones rejoice. Christ is risen from the dead. By death he's trampled death, and to those in the tombs 
he's granted life. Wisdom be attentive. In the churches bless God, from Israel's wellspring bless the Lord. Christ <clears throat> is risen <clears throat> from <clears throat> the <throat> dead. <clears throat> By death he trampled death, and to those in the tombs he's granted life. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and forever. Amen. Although you descended into the grave, O immortal one, you destroyed Hades' power. You arose as a victor, O Christ God, you exclaim to the mirth-bearing women, Rejoice! You gave peace to your apostles and granted resurrection to the fallen. <clears throat> For you are holy, our God, and we give glory to you, <clears throat> Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and ever and forever. Amen. All you who have been baptized mm -hmm. into Christ have been clothed with Christ. Alleluia. All you who have been baptized mm -hmm. into Christ have been clothed with Christ. Alleluia. All you who have been baptized into Christ have been clothed with Christ. Alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, here now and ever and forever. Amen. Have been clothed with Christ. Alleluia. All you who have been baptized into Christ, have been clothed with mm -hmm. Christ. Alleluia. Let us be attentive, peace be to all, wisdom be attentive. All through the earth their voice resounds, their message reaches to the ends of the world. The heavens declare the glory of God, and the firmament proclaims His handiwork. Through all the earth their voice resounds, their message reaches to the ends of the world. Wisdom. Let us be attentive. In those days, they returned to Jerusalem from the mount called Olivet near Jerusalem, a mere Sabbath's journey away. Entering the city, they went to the upstairs room where they were staying. Peter and John, and James and Andrew, Philip and Thomas, Bartholomew and Matthew, James, son of Alphaeus, Simon, the zealot party member, and Judas, son of James. Together they devoted themselves to constant prayer. There were some women in their company, and Mary, the mother of Jesus, and his brothers. At one point during those days, Peter stood up in the center of the brothers. There must have been a 120 gathered together. Brothers, he said, the saying in scripture uttered long ago by the Holy Spirit through the mouth of David, was destined to be fulfilled in Judas. 
the one who guided those who arrested Jesus. He was one of our number, and he had been given a share in this ministry of ours. It is entirely fitting, therefore, that one of those who was our company, while the Lord Jesus moved among us, from the baptism of John until the day he was taken up from us, should be named as witness with us to his resurrection. At that they nominated two, Joseph called Barsabbas, known as Justice, and Matthias. They prayed, O Lord, you read the hearts of men. Make known to us which of these you choose for this apostolic ministry replacing Judas, who had deserted the curse and went the way he was destined to go. They then drew lots between the two men. The choice fell to Matthias, who was added to the eleven apostles. Peace be to you, reader. Wisdom be with him. Alleluia. 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 The heavens declare your wonders, O Lord, and your truth in the assembly of the holy. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. God is glorified in the council of the holy, great and awesome above all who surround him. Alleluia. Alleluia, Alleluia. Wisdom, let us stand and listen to the Holy Gospel. Peace be to all. And to your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. John. Be attentive. No one has ever seen God. It is God, the only Son, ever at the Father's side, who has revealed Him. The testimony John gave then, the Jews sent priests and Levites from Jerusalem to ask, Who are you? was the direct statement. I am not the Messiah. They questioned him further. Who then? Elijah. I am not Elijah, he answered. Are you the prophet? No, he replied. Finally they said to him, Tell us who you are, so that we can give some answer to those who sent us. What do you have to say for yourself? John said, quoting the prophet Isaiah, I am a voice in the desert, crying out, Make straight the way of the Lord. Those whom the Pharisees had sent proceed, proceeded to question John further. If you are not the Messiah, nor Elijah, nor the prophet, why do you baptize? John answered them, I baptize with water. There is one among you whom you do not recognize, the one who is to come after me, the drap of those sandals. I am not worthy to Unfastened. This happened in Bethany, across the Jordan, where John was baptizing. Glory to you, O Lord. Glory to you. Let 
Let us all say with our whole soul and with our whole mind, let us say, Lord have mercy. <coughs> o Lord Almighty God of our fathers, we pray you here and have mercy. Lord have mercy. Have mercy on us, O God, according to your great mercy, we pray you here and have mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Mercy. Again, we pray for our Holy Father, Francis, Pope of Rome, and for our most reverend Metropolitan William, for our God-loving Bishop Kurt, for those who serve and have served in this Holy Church, for our spiritual fathers, and for all our brothers and sisters in Christ. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for our government and for all in the service of our country. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray. God, hear our supplication, and through your grace, have mercy on your servant, John Richard Hopi, grant all his petitions, and pardon all his voluntary and involuntary sins, accept his supplications and char charitable deeds before the throne of your majesty, safeguard him from every visible and invisible enemy, from every misfortune, distress, and affliction, spare him from illness, and grant him health and long life, let us all say, O Lord, hear and have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Loving Lord, look down with merciful eyes upon your servants, all people here present, and hear the supplication that we have offered up with faith. For you yourself have said, believe that you will receive whatever you ask for in prayers, and it will be yours. You also said, ask and you will receive, because of this unworthy as we are. We trust in your mercy and ask that you be merciful to your servant, John Richard Hopin, and fulfill his good desire, keep him in peace, tranquility, and health, and grant him long life. Let us all say, O Lord, hear and have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Again, we pray for the people here present who await your great and abundant mercy. For those who show us mercy and for all Christians of the true faith. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. For you are merciful and loving God and we give glory to you Father, Son and Holy Spirit now and ever and forever. Amen. Let us who Cherubim and sing the thrice holy hymn to the life creating Trinity. Now set aside all earthly cares. All earthly cares. Let us who mystically represent the cherubim and sing the thrice holy. To the life creating.
lift up your hands to the Holy Gifts and the Lord. Cares. May the Lord God remember in His kingdom our Holy Father, Francis, Pope of Rome, our most reverend Metropolitan William, our God-loving Bishop Kurt, the entire priestly, diaconal and monastic order, our government, and all in the service of our country, and the ever memorable founders and benefactors of this holy church, may the Lord God remember in his kingdom all you Christians of the true faith, always, now and ever and forever. Amen. That we may receive, receive the King of all, invisibly escorted by an For us, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Lord God Almighty, who alone are holy and receive the sacrifice of praise for all those who call upon you with, the, with their whole heart, accept also the prayer of us sinners. Bring us to your holy altar, enable us to offer you gifts and, and spiritual sacrifice for our sins and for the people's fa failings make us worthy to find favor in your sight that our sacrifice may be pleasing to you and that the good spirit of your grace may rest on us on these gifts here present and on all your people grant this through the mercies of your only begotten son with whom we are blessed together with your all holy good and life creating spirit now and ever and forever. Amen. Peace be to all. And to your spirit. Let us love one another, that with one mind we may profess. The Father <laughs> and the Son and the Holy Spirit. The Trinity, one in essence and undivided. In wisdom, let us be attentive. I believe in one God, the Father Almighty, <coughs> creator of heaven and earth, of all things visible, visible and, and invisible. invisible. And in one and in Lord, Lord Jesus Lord, Christ, Christ, Son of Son God, God, the only, the only begotten, born, born of the, the Father before all ages, light, light from, from light, true God, God from true God, God begotten, not made, made, one in essence with the Father, through whom all <laughs> things were made. For us and for our salvation, he came down from heaven and was incarnate from the Holy Spirit and the Virgin Mary and became man. He was crucified for us under Pontius Pilate and suffered and was buried. He rose on the third day according to the scriptures. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. And he is coming again in glory to judge the living and the dead. And his kingdom will have no end. And in the Holy Spirit, the Lord, the creator of life, who proceeds from the Father. Together with the Father and the Son, he is worshiped and glorified. He spoke through the prophets in one holy, Catholic, and apostolic church. I profess one baptism for the remission of sin. 
I expect the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. Amen. Let us stand right, let us stand in all, let us be attentive to offer the holy and offering peace. Mercy, peace, a sacrifice of praise. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and Father and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with all of you. And with your spirit. Let us lift up our hearts. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord. It is proper and just. It is proper and just to sing to you, to bless you, to praise you, to thank you, to worship you in every place of your dominion, for you are God. Ineffable, inconceivable, invisible, incomprehensible, ever existing, yet ever the same, you and your only begotten Son, in your Holy Spirit, you brought us out of non-existence into being and again raised us up when we had fallen and left nothing undone until you brought us to heaven and gave us your kingdom to come. For all this we thank you and your only begotten Son, in your Holy Spirit, for all that we know and that we do not know, for the manifest and hidden benefits bestowed on us. We also thank you for this liturgy which you are pleased to accept from our hands. Even though there stand before you thousands of archangels, <clears throat> tens of thousands of angels, cherubim and seraphim, six winged, many eyes, soaring aloft on their wings, singing, shouting, crying aloud, and sing the triumphal hymn. Oh. and say, Holy are you and all holy, you and your only begotten Son and your Holy Spirit. Holy are you and all holy and magnificent is your glory. You so loud your world that you give your only begotten Son so that everyone who believes in him should not perish but have life everlasting. He came and fulfilled the holy one plan in our behalf. On the night he was betrayed, or rather when he surrendered himself for the life of the world. He took bread into his holy and all pure and immaculate hands, gave thanks and blessed, sanctified, <clears throat> broke, and gave it to his holy disciples and apostles, saying, Take it, this is my body, which is broken for you, for the remission of sin. Amen. Likewise, he took chalice after supper, saying, Drink of this, all of you, this is my blood of the new covenant, which is shed for you and for many, for the remission of sin. Amen. Remembering, therefore, this seeming command, and all that has come to pass in our behalf, the cross, the tomb, the resurrection on the third day, the ascension into heaven, <clears throat> the sitting at the right hand, and the second coming in glory. Offering you your own from your own always and everywhere. We praise you, we bless you, we thank you, O Lord, and we pray to you, pray to you, our. 
blood is purified, and we implore, pray, and entreat you. Send down your Holy Spirit upon us and upon this gift lying before us, and make this bread the precious body of your Christ, and that which shall is the precious blood of your Christ. Amen. Changing them by your Holy Spirit. That for those who partake of them, they may bring about the spirit of vigilance, the remission of sins, the communion of your Holy Spirit, the fullness of the heaven, the kingdom, and confidence in you, the judgment or condemnation. Moreover, we offer you the spiritual sacrifice for those departed in faith, the forefathers, fathers, patriarchs, prophets, apostles, preachers, <coughs> evangelists, martyrs, confessors, ascetics, <coughs> and for every just spirit brought to perfection and faith. Especially for our most holy, most pure, most blessed and glorious Lady, the Theodotus and ever Virgin Mary, the angel explained to her full of grace, rejoice, O pure Virgin. And again I say rejoice, your Son is risen from the grave on the third day, and has raised the dead, rejoice all you nations. Shine in splendor, O New Jerusalem, for the glory of the Lord is risen upon you. O Zion, now dance and be glad, and you pure Theotokos, Rejoice in the resurrection of your Son. Among the first Lord, <clears throat> remember our Holy Father Francis, Pope of Rome, our most reverend venerable and William, our God-loving Bishop Kurt. Preserve them for your holy churches in peace, safety, honor, and health for many years. As they faithfully impart the word of your truth. And remember <clears throat> all your people. Remember, O Lord, the city in which we dwell, and every city and community, and the faithful living in them. Remember, O Lord, those who travel by sea, air and land, for the sake of the suffering, the captive, and grant them salvation. Remember, O Lord, those who bring offerings and perform good deeds in your holy churches, and those who remember the poor. And upon all of us, send down your mercies, <clears throat> and grant that, with one voice and one heart, we may glorify and praise your most honored and magnificent name, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, of endeavor, and forever. Amen. May the mercies of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ, be with all of you. And with your spirit. Now that we have commemorated all the saints again and again in peace, let us pray to the Lord. O Lord, have mercy. For the precious gifts offered and consecrated, that our God who loves us all may receive them on his holy heavenly and mystical altars in our almost spiritual fragrance and send down upon us in return His divine grace and the gift of the Holy Spirit. Let us pray. Lord, have mercy. That we be delivered from all affliction, wrath, and need. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Protect us, save us, have mercy on us, and preserve us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. That is all evening be perfect, holy, peaceful, and without sin. Let us beseech the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. For an angel of peace, a faithful guide and guardian of our souls and bodies, let us beseech the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. For the pardon and remission of our sins and offenses, let us beseech the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. For what is good and beneficial unto our souls and for peace in the world. Let us beseech the Lord, grant this, O Lord, that we may spend the rest
rest of our life in peace and repentance, let us beseech the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. For aggression, painless, unashamed, peaceful, and of our life and for a good account before the fearsome judgment seat of Christ, let us beseech the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. Asking for unity in the faith and for a communion of the Holy Spirit, let us commit ourselves in one another and our whole life. To Christ our God. To you, O Lord. To you, O Master, who love us all, we commit our whole life and hope, and we implore, pray, and entreat you. Make us worthy to partake with a clear conscience of your heavenly and awesome mysteries from this sacred and spiritual table. May they bring about the remission of sins, the pardon of trans transgressions, the communion of the Holy Spirit, the inheritance of the kingdom of heaven, confidence in you, not judgment or condemnation. And make us worthy, O Master, that we may with confidence and without condemnation there call you Father, God of heaven, and say, Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil for sign in the kingdom and the power and the glory father son and holy spirit now and ever and forever. Amen. Peace be to all. And to your spirit. Bow your heads to the Lord. To you, you give thanks, O Lord. Lord. Remember, Father, you have fashioned all things in the greatness of your mercy. You have brought all things out of existence into being. Look down from heaven, O Master, upon those who bow their heads to you, for they do not bow to flesh and blood, but you, the awesome God. <clears throat> Therefore, O Master, make smooth for the good of all, the path that lies ahead, according to the need of each. Sail with those who sail, travel with those who travel. Cure those who are sick, of physician of souls and bodies. Through the grace, the mercies, and the loving kindness of your only begotten Son, with whom you are blessed, together with your all holy good and life creating spirit, now and ever and forever. Ah, Amen. Amen. Let us be attentive, holy gifts, to holy people. One is holy. that you are truly Christ, the Son of the living God, who came into the world to save sinners, of whom I ask the first. Accept me today as a partaker of your mystical supper, O Son of God, for I will not reveal your mystery to your enemies, nor will I give you a kiss as to Judas, but like the thief I profess you. Remember me, O Lord, when you come in your kingdom. Remember me, O Master, when you come in your kingdom. Remember me, O Holy One, when you come in your kingdom. May the partaking of your holy mysteries, O Lord, be not for my judgment or condemnation, but for the healing of soul and body. O Lord, I also believe and profess that this which I am about to receive is truly your most precious body and your life-giving blood, which I pray make me worthy to receive for the remission of all my sins and for life everlasting. Amen. O God, be merciful to me, a sinner. O God, cleanse me of my sins and have mercy on me. O Lord, forgive me, for I have sinned without number. Receive the body of Christ. 
drink the source of immortality, receive the body of Christ, drink the source of immortality. is risen from the dead by death we tremble dead and to those in the tombs he's granted life Christ is risen Christ is risen Christ is risen Christ is risen from the dead by death, by death, he trampled death. By death, by death, he trampled death. And to those in the tombs, and to those in the tombs, he's granted, he's granted, he's granted life. Christ is risen from the dead. Christ, Christ is, is risen from, from the, the dead. dead. Christ, Christ is risen from the dead. By death is trampled By death is He's granted, he's granted, he's granted life. Christ is risen, Christ is risen. Joy from heaven is around us. Christ our Pash now dwells among us. Lift your hearts and lift your voices. Mankind gratefully rejoices. God gave gladness from above. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. Christos vos crece is met vee, smetius met poprao, Jesus chivorobi, chivodarova. Save your people, O God, and bless your inheritance. Christ is risen. Christ is risen from the dead. By death he trampled death, and to those in the tombs he's granted life. Blessed is our God always, now and ever and forever. Christ is risen. Christ is risen from, from the, the dead. dead. By death he trampled death, and to those in the tombs he's granted life. Christos vos crece is met vee. Smetius met poprao, Jesus chivorobi, Jivodarova. 
Christ is risen from the dead. By death he trampled death, and to those in the tombs he's granted life. Arise, now that we have received the divine, holy, most pure, immortal, heavenly, life-creating and awesome mysteries of Christ, let us mortally thank the Lord. The Lord have mercy. For you are our sanctification, and we give glory to you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, now and ever and forever. Amen. Let us go forth in peace. In the name <clears throat> of the Lord. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Passover, Passover, and again I say Passover for Christ. Our Passover, He being sacrificed for us. He alone is immortal. He alone cannot be seen. Our grasp, the angels and principalities, the authorities, the minions, and powers and the cherubim and seraphim praised him praise him with these heavenly powers we your unworthy servants praise bless and worship you o lord our god for in these last days you came into the world took flesh from our holy and pure lady the mother of god and ever virgin mary and crucif and suffered crucifixion that you might free us from the course of the tree. For all this, how can we repay you, O God, according to nature and Father, according to grace? We offer you praise from our lips. Glory to you who were baptized. Glory to you who were crucified. Glory to you who were buried. Glory to you for you are risen and raised us with you. Glory to you together with your eternal Father and your all holy good and life creating spirit <clears throat> now and ever and forever. Amen. Christ is risen from the dead. By death he trampled death and to those in the tombs he's granted life. The blessing of the Lord be upon you through His grace and loving kindness always, now and ever and forever. Amen. Glory to you, Christ God, our hope, glory to you. Lord, Christ Amen. is risen from, from the dead, dead. by death he's trampled death, death. And, and to glory. those in the tombs he's granted life. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, give the blessing. May Christ our true God, risen from the dead, by death trampling death, and granting life to those in the tombs, have mercy on us and save us through the prayers of His most pure Mother, Patroness of this Holy Church, and of our Holy Father, John Chrysostom, Archbishop of Constantinople, and through the prayers of all the saints, for Christ is good, <clears throat> and He loves us all. Ah, amen. To all people here present, and especially to our brother John Richard Hoppe, grant to Lord many years, Christ is risen. God grant us many years. God grant us many years. God grant us many blessed years. In health and happiness. In health and happiness. God Christ is grant risen. us many blessed years. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. Christ is risen. 
Christ is risen. Christ is risen from the dead. By death he trampled death, and to those in the tomb he's granted life. Jesus was most crescent, is met with, met you, met for proud, Jesus, Jehovah, Jehovah, wow, Christ is risen from the dead, by death he trampled death. And to those in the tombs, he's granted life. And Now, to us, he's, he's granted, granted life, life eternal. eternal. Let us bow before his resurrection on the <clears throat> third day. Da vos kresne dvoh, i da rastočatca v razi jeho, i da bižat od lica jeho. Nenavidjaši i jeho, Paska svjašćena je nam dnes pokaza sa, Paska nova svjata ja, Paska tajnstvena ja, Paska se česna ja, Paska Hristos izbavitelj. Paska neporočna ja, Paska velika ja, Paska virnih, Paska dveri rajskija nam otvrzajuša ja, Paska vsih osvješćajuša ja virnih. Jako iš je zajedim da